Hi everyone, Michael and Trevor Tolo here from Solution Systems. And today we're gonna to talk about getting your Outlook tests into Microsoft Teams in under two minutes. So hopefully you've been using Microsoft Teams for many months now and you found it to be not only a wonderful collaboration tool, but also a great productivity tool. When it comes to productivity with any software, it can always be better. And this video is really just gonna focus on how to extend the team's productivity abilities by connecting your Outlook tasks within Microsoft Teams. So if you're anything like me, my Outlook tasks play a big part in my daily work activities. Anytime I can add these tasks to a software that I'm using is a win in my book, as it instantly increases my productivity levels, because I'm not wasting time switching in and out of different apps. So months back when I read that Outlook tasks could be imported into Teams, I immediately questioned how, because I had gone through plenty, plenty different times through the settings, you know, to see if this was really an option. Well, it turns out it is an option, and it's a really easy option, but to get this option, you have to install the Planner app. So let's go ahead here and see how we do that. So let's go down here to Apps. Let's search for Planner. Oh, quick disclosure, my tasks, I've set up task one, task two, so we'll know when we import these tasks if they really are imported. Oh, let's go back here to Apps. Let's go to search for Planner. Select it and click Add. And there it is, task one and task two. So once the Planner app is installed, you're going to be able to see all your tasks, uh, important tasks, planned tasks, and tasks that have been assigned to you. Um, if you click the ellipsis next to the task, you have the option of updating the progress to be completed or you know not started, setting the priority to important or medium, selecting a due date, moving the task, and deleting the task. So it's pretty nice. Also at the at the bottom of the planner page, you can create a new list or plan that can be created in my tasks uh, for your team groups. At the top of the planner page, you have the option to show all um, show all active tasks or all completed tasks. You can select filter and filter by keyword date, you know, late today, tomorrow, this week, next week, future, no date, with due date and by priority. So all in all, it's a great idea to integrate Outlook tests into Microsoft Teams, and it takes less than two minutes 